hello um, to the Skyrim Nexus in YouTube. Um, welcome to our announcement of Plopdo Adventuring Companies. I am Robert, also known as Blast391, the lead developer. And I'm Sam, also known as the Brainbox, lead writer for the mod in its current state. Yep, at the moment its current state is about a Word document because... Well, Google Docs. Creation, yeah, the creation kit isn't out yet, so we can't do anything with it. But as soon as it's out, we're going to get straight to it. Um, get all our quests sorted. We're planning on releasing it in quick, small chunks. And yeah. this is the bit we're not decided on yet. Where quest by quest basis releasing it or do a large chunk and release it what, or what what I think we should do is we should um, have a handful of beta testers who like uh, who get it as as it goes and then for everyone else release it on quest by quest as soon as uh, we're sure that it's ready so just comment on the Skyrim Nexus or on YouTube or on our forum there's many ways of getting in contact with us and just tell us what you want from this mod, what you think about it. A uh, quick overview of this mod is it's sort of semi-comedic, taking itself not too seriously, <laughs> but having Definitely not. a high-quality standard we're hoping for. Yeah, fully voice-acted, uh, series of new quests, hopefully some new items. And uh, lots of uh, new and lovable characters. A new so plane of oblivion, that. if everything goes according to plan. Yep, um, that's called the tube, and it's going to be one... ...is going to be controlled by mortals, so, like, people who are highly trained in it can control this plane and create it in sort of their vision, much like the Daedric Gods can. Unfortunately, the player won't be able to do this because I'm not a genius with scripting and it's supposed to take years of training, which may be quite dull in a game-playing basis. <laughs> so yes, we've got our main villain, Daniel, and many other features waiting to come. Uh, basically, most of plot do will be voice acting in it. Uh... Under assumed names, of course, but uh, you'll probably be able to tell that it's them. Yep. So, comment on what you think about this mod, what you want to know about it, anything, and just tell us. Yeah. I'd be happy to help. Plot, plot ideas, ideas for new items, tips and tricks to do with coding and stuff like that. Yep. That sort of thing. I'm... Um, Hoping the creation kit's going to be similar to the Gamebryo engine construction kit, but with for Oblivion and Morrowind because I'm rather good at that. Mm. But if not, then it may be a bit slow on release. But I will definitely get to learn this engine because I love Skyrim. So thank you and stay tuned for more information. Anything else you want to say, Sam? Um. Not particularly. Uh, just stay tuned. We're hope we're hoping that this uh, takes off a bit and uh, hopefully uh, improves the popularity of our channel as well. But uh, I mean, even just having a few people than our friends playing, it would be good. Yeah, so we're just, trying to make um, it as high quality as possible. Watch the watch the um, forum post. On YouTube the Nexus. channel will be posting updates on as well. And also the forum, but that's more for new, like, really official news for, like, each time there's a release, we'll post it on the forum. And if you've got bugs when it's finally released, post that on the forum. Um, and we'll get to you. Right. Well, I think so, that's yep. it. Yep. Uh, so. See you guys next time. Yep.